pH is a very common measure for the acidity of a solution. Here we'll define it and show you how to convert from hydronium ion concentration to pH and from pH to hydronium ion concentration. We'll start by showing you how to find the pH of a solution if we're given the hydronium ion concentration. pH is defined as the negative log of the hydronium ion concentration. Just a little bit about logs. The log of a given number is the number of times 10 is multiplied by itself to equal the number. For example, 10 times 10 is equal to 10 to the power of 2, or 100. Because two 10s were multiplied to give 100, the log of 100, or 10 squared, is equal to 2. 10 multiplied by itself three times is equal to 10 to the power of 3, or 1000. The log of 1,000, or 10 to the power of 3, is equal to 3. If a number is simply 10 to the power of something, the exponent on the 10 is equal to the log of the number. Molar concentrations in chemistry, expressed in scientific notation, usually have a negative exponent on the 10. For example, consider a solution in which the concentration of hydronium is 0.1 molar or 10 to the negative 1 molar. The log of the hydronium ion concentration is negative 1. To avoid the use of negative numbers, pH was defined as the negative log of the hydronium ion concentration rather than the log of the hydronium ion concentration. We have seen that the log of the hydronium ion concentration is negative 1. So the negative log of a hydronium ion concentration is the negative of negative 1 which is positive 1. Let's do a few examples. We have a solution in which the hydronium ion concentration is 0 0.001 molar. In scientific notation, that's 1 times 10 to the negative 3 molar. The log of 10 to the negative 3 is negative 3, so the pH, or negative log, of 10 to the negative 3 is just positive 3, or 3. Pause the video and try to complete the table for these on your own without a calculator. Then resume the video to check your answers. In a different solution, the hydronium ion concentration is 0 0.0001 molar. In scientific notation, the concentration is 1 times 10 to the negative fourth molar. And the negative log of 1 times 10 to the negative fourth, or the pH, is just 4. In pure water at 25 degrees, the hydronium ion concentration is 0 0.0000001 molar, which is the same as 1 times 10 to the negative 7th molar. So the pH is equal to 7. In a certain basic solution, the hydronium ion concentration is 0 0.0000000001 molar, which if you check, you will see is 1 times 10 to the negative 10th molar so the pH is equal to 10. Of course, most solutions have concentrations that are not just simple powers of 10. For example, we're asked to find the pH of 0 0.035 molar HNO3. First of all, we can classify HNO3, or nitric acid, as a strong acid. Because it's a strong acid, the concentration of hydronium is equal to the concentration of the acid which is 0 0.035 molar. So we can simply say that the concentration of hydronium is 0 0.035 molar. We start off with the statement that pH is equal to the negative log of hydronium ion concentration. Now we substitute 0 0.035 in for the concentration of hydronium. Now using a calculator, we find the negative log of 0 0.035, and it comes out to this number. So how do we round this off? The concentration they gave us has two significant figures. So we need to round our answer to two significant figures. For a pH value, only the digits after the decimal point are counted as significant figures. So rounding this to two significant figures gives us 1.46 for pH. It's very important to know that any digits to the left of the decimal point in a pH are not significant figures. So the 1 in this pH value is not a significant figure. Only digits to the right of the decimal point in a pH, the 4 and the 6 in this case, are significant figures. 
and notice that pH values are expressed without any units. Here are a few examples for you to try. Make sure you express the pH to the number of significant figures used in each given hydronium ion concentration. Pause the video and try these, then resume the video to check your answers. This is the time to get all the little details straight in your mind. You'll be doing many calculations involving pH and hydronium ion concentrations in the rest of this course. The given hydronium ion concentration has three significant figures, so the pH must be expressed to three decimal places. The pH is equal to the negative log of hydronium, or the negative log of 0 0.00367 which comes out to 2.435 expressed to three decimal places. The three decimal places in the pH value provide the three significant figures that correspond to the three significant figures in 0 0.00367 molar. The hydronium ion concentration in this example has two significant figures, so the pH must be expressed to two decimal places. The unit moles per liter is the same as molarity, or molar concentration, or capital M. Again, pH is equal to the negative log of the hydronium ion concentration, which in this case is the negative log of 0.14, which to two decimal places is 0.85. This hydronium ion concentration has five significant figures. The pH must be expressed to five decimal places. The pH is negative log of hydronium ion concentration, which is the negative log of 6.5219, which comes out to negative 0.81437. This is expressed to five decimal places. We can see that it is possible to have a negative value for pH. These occur with relatively high hydronium ion concentrations. The hydronium ion concentration here is 12 molar. This has two significant figures, so the pH must be expressed to two decimal places. Again, pH is the negative log of the hydronium ion concentration, which is the negative log of 12, which comes out to an answer of negative 1.08 when expressed to two decimal places. The 0 and the 8 are the two significant figures in this pH. Again, the high hydronium ion concentration gives rise to a negative value for pH. Sometimes we'll be given the pH of a solution and asked to find the hydronium ion concentration. To do this, we use the formula concentration of hydronium is equal to 10 to the negative pH. 10 to the negative pH is called the antilog of the negative pH. When using this formula, Use the 10 to the x function on the calculator and make sure you enter the negative of the pH value rather than the pH value itself. 10 to the x is the second function above the log button on many calculators. Let's do an example. We're asked to find the concentration of hydronium in a solution in which the pH is equal to 4.876. We start with the formula hydronium ion concentration is 10 to the negative pH. We substitute 4.876 in for pH. Remember the exponent is the negative of the pH value. Our calculator gives us an answer something like this. This is obviously too many significant figures, so how do we round this off? The pH value of 4.876 has three significant figures. Remember in a pH that only digits after the decimal point are significant figures. This number is a molar concentration, not a pH, so we use the normal rules for significant figures. We need to round this to three significant figures. We include the first three digits, starting from the left. The number to the left of the decimal, the one in this case, is significant in a normal concentration value. The digit following the last significant figure is less than five, so we do not round the last three up to a four. So the final answer is the concentration of hydronium is 1.33 times 10 to the negative fifth molar. Remember the exponent part of the number is not counted as significant figures. Here are a few examples for you to try. 
Make sure you express the hydronium ion concentration to the number of significant figures used in each given pH. Pause the video and try these, then resume the video to check your answers. The given pH, 2.61, has two significant figures. The concentration of hydronium is equal to 10 to the power of negative pH, which is 10 to the power of negative 2.61. The 2.61 is a pH value, so it has two significant figures. So the final answer comes to 2.5 times 10 to the negative 3 molar when rounded to the required two significant figures. Note that 0 0.0025 molar would also be the correct answer for this one. The second pH given has only one significant figure. The concentration of hydronium is 10 to the power of negative pH which is 10 to the negative 5.3. The concentration of hydronium must be rounded to one significant figure, and the answer is 5 times 10 to the negative 6. The answer to this one has three significant figures, and it comes out to 3.81 times 10 to the negative 9 molar. The answer to the last one has four significant figures, and it comes out to 1.000 times 10 to the negative 6th molar.